Okay, now, oh, another thing that's just fantastic, and it's, you know, it's one of my favourites here, and I love this, and I have travelled down to Mexico, so I know um, a little bit of this uh, Mexican style, and guacamole is really fantastic. So what I'm going to do here, look, I'm going to cut a, cut a couple of these guys. I'm going to uh, show you uh, a simple, easy uh, recipe for, um, for guacamole, and, uh, and, and, and see what you guys think. Okay, so here we go, we're going to cut a couple of these guys. Cut him open. Look at that. They look so, so nice. Crack him in here. Twist again. And cut another one. And I think we'll probably even cut a third. I think we can just do something really nice here. So there's... It's ready to eat. It looks really nice. And... And cut this one as well. I think this is this looks nice too. Is it's a nice avocado. It's looking really ready to eat, and we're going to throw this in as well. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to cut this one. I'm going to uh, scoop it out with a spoon, and just give you a pretty easy idea. Just move him out as well. So there we've got three avocados. Now that's probably you know I would say something like this is probably from you know four to six people. Um, okay, so uh, I'll let me just grab a spoon from over here, and what we do is we're just going to scoop this and scoop it out. Then I'll use a fork. The green in the avocado is always really nice as well. I'll just bring this over here, make it a little bit easier so you can see what's going on here, and uh, I think we'll put a Good variety of these in here. Scoop it out, nice and easy. And I can use the fork to uh, mix it up a little bit. There we go. Probably. And one more. I'll leave these guys here. Okay, so there we can have we can have the avocados. I'll just give these a little bit of a, a little bit of a squash up here. I'll use a fork just to press this down a little bit and you know just get the the, the nice consistency of what we're looking for to make this guacamole. So okay, so there we go. You can see that the avocados were really nice and really nice and uh, and ripe and ready to use. Um, now earlier in the day, I just cut up, I diced up a few tomatoes and some onion. Um, we can put chili as well, but today we're having a a little feast here, and we've got kids, so we don't really want to use chili. But if you like something a little bit spicier, there's you know the sweet chili sauce and the you know the uh, the different types of uh, salsa sauces that can be used. But today we're going to put some. I like a little bit of garlic, so we're going to tip some garlic into here. <clears throat> and that's just nice and nice and easy. This was diced a little bit earlier, so it's tomatoes that are going into this. Okay, so diced tomatoes that go into that as well. And earlier uh, we diced some onion. And uh, I've cut that up with a little bit of capsicum as well. And, well, looks like this, this bowl is a little bit small, but it gives you the basic idea of what we're doing here. And uh, now we can mix all this in. And I'm going to put a little bit of salt, a little bit of olive oil. It's got to go into this. Don't have to put too much, just a little bit. A little bit of salt and pepper. Um, you can see this just goes in as well. A little bit of lemon, a little bit of lime. Squeeze a little bit of lemon. Take out the seeds. So we can just remove the seeds that are in here. There we go, and a little bit of lime, a little bit of lime juice is good to get in here, and a lemon juice. 
Watch out the seeds don't go in. And a little bit of lime, which is fantastic. So we can just give this a bit of a bit of a twist around as well. Okay, it's a little bit messy here, but you guys, you can see what I'm doing here. It's just fantastic, and it's just going to be get a really nice mix going in here. And this is a guacamole from hell, I can tell you. I really enjoy enjoy this. Okay, I'm going to put a little bit of a little bit of salsa sauce in here as well, just uh, for this size bowl. I would put. Uh, there we go, a spoon and a half is, teaspoon and a half is fine. And then just mix this all in. And this is, you've got to give it a real good mix around. And there we go. This is, okay, and it's starting to mix up really nicely now. Now you can actually put some other sauces, you know, they can be, uh, they can be, uh, you know, a little bit of soy sauce, a little bit of a wish to see a sauce if, if that's, you know, if that's, um, if that's you'd like to make it a little bit spicier and, and, and you know, have a little bit more bite to it. Uh, but I think the salsa sauce and, you know, especially if you've got kids eating this as well, and it's not too hot. It's a really nice, uh, it's a really nice thing here. So there we go. We're mixing that really nicely. And we're just about, so you can see the consistency starting to come up now. It's, uh, it's just looking really, really nice and tasty. There we go. Okay, so what I'm going to do, I'm just going to have a little taste of this because it's been so much work in putting all this together. And uh, I'll take one of these guys here and just have a little taste and I'll tell you what this is going to be like because I'm sure this is going to be really good. It was fantastic making all this. It was a really nice guacamole that I enjoy and uh, let's see how we go. Mmm, mmm. Listen, I tell you, that is so good. I've just got to have another quick one. Just hold on a sec. All right. That is absolutely fantastic. So, one more quick one. Mm. And uh, there it is. And I hope um, hope you enjoy that. Now, oh, look, one quick thing. God, just uh, got so excited with the guacamole, but just one quick thing here. Um, in Australia... As I said to you, we love avocados. Avocados are fantastic. We eat them with many different things. And um, we have we have a um, we have an extract. Uh, it's called Vegemite down here. We have a it's like a, a vegetable extract that's fantastic, and many people like it. Some don't like it as much, but most do. And one of the things that I think is fantastic is avocado and and Vegemite. So look, I just want to. Uh, I just want to give you a, a quick rundown on this um, and just have a just have a look at this for a second. I think you'll like it. So hold on a sec, I'll just grab the I've got some toast over here in the toaster. And uh, what we'll do is uh, I'll grab a little bit of just let me give that a bit of a quick wipe. I'll grab a little bit of Vegemite, and I'll show you how to do this, and it's really nice. So Vegemite, it's a product from Australia. For all you guys that are in, you know, other parts of the world, Vegemite is really an Australian product. It's fantastic. We've had this since we were kids, and Vegemite's a really nice thing. Um, so basically what we're going to do here is we'll take, on a piece of toast, a knife size. Okay, now this is something that, you know, look... It's just an Aussie thing, and it's just a really nice, uh, just a really nice thing we do down here. Okay, so we can just cut this in little strips. We can do it again like this, and just just make it nice, and it just comes out of the shell really nice and easy. And then we can just spread 
some of this on the toast with Vegemite. Now I'm going to taste this as well because it's just, I know this is going to be good. Okay, so we can, we've got the Vegemite on the, the Vegemite on the bottom. Okay, that's spread out here. This is, as I said to you, it's just an Aussie thing that, an Australian thing that we've just done for many, many years. We can cut this. The kids love it. It can just be a simple, nice, easy to put on a plate and just make it nice and presentable. Here we go. There's the avocado. Um, I'm just going to have a little taste of this just to tell you what it's like, as in being Vegemite and avocado on a sandwich. Aussie thing. You'll have to enjoy this and try it one day, wherever you are. Mmm. Lovely. Such a nice combination. Two very strong, different flavours. Great to eat, easy to make. Avocados, enjoy. Mm -hmm.